Hi, Grandma. Grandma? Who is this? You woke me. It's me, Anthony Jr. No, oh, I didn't know I had a grandson. I miss you. Yeah, you should. You never come see me. I've been busy. Everybody's busy. And don't lie to me. I know your father forbids you're coming down here. He doesn't, honest. He just doesn't want us to talk about you in the house. Oh, he can go shit in his hat. He's mad at me right now. Oh, I shouldn't use that kind of talk. Don't let me ever catch you talking that way. Now, what'd you do bad? My dad doesn't like my attitude. So Uncle Pussy said that I should come down here and talk to you because you're old and have wisdom and stuff. Oh, his mother's another one. Well, what'd you do? I took Mom's car out of the garage and it got wrecked. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. Was it bad? Uncle Pussy already fixed it. Did you wear your safety belt? Yeah. Because there was an article in the paper the other day about a bunch of teenagers from out near the Delaware Water Gap. They overcrowded their car, it hit a tree, and it incinerated. And they got trapped. People could hear them screaming. They couldn't get out. The safety belts did it. Buckled them in. See, that's what I mean. What's the purpose? Of what? Being here on our planet. Earth. Those kids were dead meat. What's the use? What's the purpose? Why does everything have to have a purpose? The world is a jungle. And if you want my advice, Anthony, don't expect happiness. You won't get it. People let you down. And I'm not naming any names. But in the end, you die in your own arms. You mean alone? It's all a big nothing. What makes you think you're so special? <laughs>